Very fandom news on GFTV News. Welcome. While furries all had fun in Midwest Fur Fest this year, there are outliers. A few people took to the streets outside of the furry convention's venue, seemingly to protest against furries. They held signs saying furries are gay. This is not normal, and this is what a dying society looks like. Furries are shocked. Some are amused. One even said they were glad they did not join the furcon to avoid potential harassment. These protesters reportedly insulted other attendees. Event security was mobilized. Reports claim Midwest Fur Fest also expelled them from the venue. Fairies don't go to fairy conventions only, but to anime ones too. At this year's Anime Festival Asia, or AFA, whether in costume or not, attendees had much fun costuming and living out their favorite characters. Likewise for fairies there. Roaming around the convention, they sure were magnets for cuddles and cameras. AFA returned this year in person after Singapore loosened major COVID policies eight months ago in end March. We got some breaking news coming in. Please stand by. Big announcements from Little Island Furcon or LIFC for their next event. They will hold an in-person event on June 11th, June 10th to 11th, 2023. The venue is Resorts World Sentosa's Convention Center. It is said to be three times bigger than their 2019 venue. LIFC Chairman Scalarius says registrations may open from early January to early February 2023. These dates are not final. No attendee cap for now. The Furcon will also hold online on November 1st, 2023. Almost every year, there are new Pokemons. This year, Sprigatito, Fucoco, and Quexley make the cover page. We look at the case at Jurong Point in Singapore. Three hours before the Pokemons enter, shoppers are already waiting. Later at 3 p.m. local, Pikachu and Pipup joined the trio. They began dancing, galvanizing people around. Together, they brought fun to shoppers and Pokemon fans, young and old, for the afternoon. That's all Fairy Fandom News. For more Fairy News, visit bit.ly slash fairytv. Have a great and wonderful Sophie Day. <laughs>